In this coming series, I wanted to mix things up a little bit. I wanted to do something that I was just a little bit more passionate about. And anybody that hangs out with me knows that I'm passionate about boondocking and uh, self-reliance. In this coming series, I wanted to mix things up a little bit. I wanted to do something that I was just a little bit more passionate about. And anybody that hangs out with me knows that I'm passionate about boondocking and uh, self-reliance. Uh, please show your support and click on the links in the description below. <laughs> oh, f freaking broke, f freaking broke, and I'm so far away from home. F freaking broke, and I'm so far away from home that I'm starting to get scared. And there's a lot of free boondocking around here, so I'm, I got... You know, and it's within 30 miles, so I'm gonna. I have all those places to check out, and I'm just gonna take it easy this month while, while I wait for some more income. While I wait for some more income, and while I wait for some more income, and that kid's about as sharp as a pound of wet leather. And boondocking pretty much as long as you can in comfort. This is gonna be the ultimate test. Got the pump here. Of course, uh, this is my first time doing this, so um, it's not set up real great. Oh yeah. It's not the clearest. You could filter it through two filters, but considering that came from super muddy water, I think this is a success. I would uh, definitely shower with this water. I would also wash dishes with this water. And yeah, sober would definitely drink it. Now we've got it going through two water filters. There's one down there and there's one filter up here. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'd drink that. <laughs> Woo, I'd drink that. Yeah. There we go. You're gone. A full tank and I didn't go to a dump station. So I am contributing to society. <laughs>